Hey, what's up guys? Totally Dubbed here again, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you again the Zonar DX issue. Um, the static noise that I get, uh, this is a brand new DX that I got, uh, which was kindly provided by Overclockers UK. However, um, I have the same problem with the DX, and this is with the official um, drivers installed. So what I'm going to do is unplug the jack and put it back again. Uh, this is a 3.5mm jack, just to show you guys um, that it's not jack related. So I'll do it from the back of the computer. So as you can see, uh, it's nothing to do with the jack, and I can also guarantee you it's nothing to do with the power. So I complained about it, well I just posted about it on um, overclockers.net, and um, user uh, T <laughs> Tiho Kati uh, posted a link um, to restart the audio drivers, so that's what I'm going to do right now. Um, I will link the descript uh, link down that um, file on my um, on my dev host account and so what you have to do if you click the readme you'll see over here instructions and you have to put um, you have to put the devcon um, application into windows system 32 so let's open up here C uh, windows system 32 and I've already put it in but uh, I just want to show you guys. Uh, let's get to it. Devcon. There you go. It's over there. Let's zoom in. So you guys can see. Devcon, which is in there. And now you have to run the uh, fix sound loop uh, just a few times. So it comes up with this. press any key to continue press any key to continue just hear the clicking of the um, the zonar just there and let's see if this works reopen it there we go so that's all working as it should So there you go guys, that's a, um, a, a fix that you can do um, without restarting the PC, which is quite useful. And um, therefore, I would highly suggest it because it saves you from restarting the PC in case you're in the middle of doing something. But I just still find it extremely sloppy from um, Asus for um, having a crap, utterly crap driver. So as you can see, it is driver related and I'm on the official Asus drivers, so there's no excuses there from anyone, um, including Asus, to say, oh, you're not on... Inf no, I am on official Asus drivers, and I have been ever since I installed my brand new uh, Zonar DX card, and I still have the problem, and therefore I'll probably go to unified drivers because I preferred them, seeing as the drivers, the Asus drivers suck anyway, um, there's no there's no difference if I'm gonna have the problem on well as I have the problem on a driver I prefer so anyway guys I hope this video is helpful and as I said I'll link down in the description below um, a link for this file it will be a zip file as you can see over here it's a zip file and um, you will have to unzip it and then you'll get this file as I showed you before alright guys see you totally dubbed out bye bye